So many different paths have led them to just four lanes. And frame after frame, they share the same aim. Wallingford is Splitsville. And for these veterans, that's just fine. Once a Marine, always a Marine. Hoorah. At Bolero, Gaylord Hospital Sports Association has a new program. And if you're near it, you'll hear it. This is our Veterans Adaptive Bowling Program that we just started this year. Yep. So the program is for veterans who have a physical disability, visual impairment, or PTSD. Front and center are retired service men and women from every branch. Bowling is possible no matter what your ability is. We have a grant with Southern Connecticut State University through the VA Adaptive Sports Grant, um, and we're partnering with the VA West Haven. For 15 veterans here in Wallingford, it's a chance to knock everything down, but also raise each other up. Retired Marine Lance Corporal Tony Lucas is here from Hartford. I only have one word to say, Jim. It's awesome. It's the camaraderie that we have amongst each other. And what I found is through community is how we heal, and Gaylord provides us a community. The fellowship, the camaraderie, to be able to learn a new skill and to share it with your friends and your peers. And apparently the expression, slow your roll, isn't applicable here. The best part is being out here with my fellow veterans. This is a way we can give back, and it's a way we can give back to our veterans who have already given so much to us. In Wallingford, Jim Altman, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.